had a week to reflect on Saturday's game. How have your thoughts on it changed since? I think we just have to move on. Obviously, training comes thick and fast, and the next game is ahead of us. So we just need to focus on um, certain elements of our game, make sure we keep improving, and then hopefully it turns into the right result this weekend. Has there been any specific focus you've wanted to implement on the team this week in training? Just to keep improving our organisation, keep improving the fitness and just tweaking things here and there. So, you know, we've been working really hard on our distances off the ball and then looking to um, get the ball down again and keep improving our style of play. So we're just looking to develop with every game. Of course, one of the pleasing aspects was when we were falling down in the 90th minute, the girls didn't stop, they carried on and they got a consolation goal. Is that something you tried to instil in the players during pre-season? Yeah, no matter what, we've got to keep playing the right way, keep doing the things that we believe are, are the right things to do in the game and, you know, they never ever give up. So it's something, uh, obviously, we can be proud of as a team and it's something that will continue, I'm sure, and we've got to keep um, pushing that message home with every game and, and every training session to just keep trying our best no matter what. So next up, we travel to Sheffield on Saturday, one of your former clubs. Are you looking forward to seeing some more friends? Yeah, it should be good. Sheffield is a is a good club again with a very good history, and you know it'll be great to go back up there and see some old faces. And I'm sure it'll be a very good game. So um, we're excited about it. I'm sure Sheffield will be trying their best to to get a win as well. So uh, you know, I'm really looking forward to it. What do you know about Sheffield? How do they play? Well, again, Sheffield like to play good football. They're they're a, a tough tackling team. They're organised. So it's Again, it's going to be difficult as is any game in this division, so we'll have to be at the races to make sure we get something out of the game and um, you know, we'll, we'll do our best to make sure we can do that. How do you try and minimise the disadvantage, uh, the travel in between the causes? Well, we've just got to make sure that, the, that we travel with ample time to get there and prepare with stop-offs in between and, and make sure that the girls know exactly what they need to do to keep their legs moving, keep the mind ticking over and just purely focus when we step up that bus to make sure that we get you know, the girls prepared mentally and physically for the kick-off. Of course, the question that's on the minds of all London Beats fans right now, will it be suit or no suit this weekend? Well, you have to wait and see for that one. I think um, the suit went down quite well this weekend, but we'll have to wait and see if it, might be a tracksuit, might be a suit.